Hey there everybody, you already know it. It's Red from Fulgroom Esports and we're gonna talk about the finals of the MPL playoffs. But before that, let's rewind a little bit and talk about the amazing Cinderella run from Echo. Echo, of course, our defending world champions did not have an easy go as they lost in a hard fought best of five with RSG, the Raiders coming out on top, essentially making Echo drop down to the loser's bracket. And in the loser's bracket, Echo is on thin ice because one loss means that they drop out of the bracket and that they no longer have a chance at the MSC. And after beating every single team that they fight, who else shows up in the last legs but RSG, where now they're able to beat the Raiders and secure their spot in the grand finals. And in the grand finals, what a showing from Echo. We do end up seeing an amazing best of seven where they drop zero games blacklist. Up until this point, they were undefeated, but it didn't matter. Blacklist, of course, are veterans, but they're fighting the reigning world champions here. And Echo takes them down handily ending the first game in a 15-4 scoreline that is 15 kills for echo versus blacklist's measly four kills in the next game the story was not that much different it was still complete domination on the side of echo where they steamroll blacklist and completely assert their dominance which ended in a 7-16 scoreline in the favor of Echo. That is still 16 kills versus Blacklist 7. This of course provides the momentum that Echo wants and needs to carry this home for them. And it just shows as they step into game 3 and dominate. Managing to close out this game with a 22-5 scoreline. Now coming into the last game on the other hand. It's a bit of a different story as Blacklist has an early gold lead and they get a nice pick off here on the yaoi but echo is quick to respond and they are quick to shut down blacklist effectively turning the early goal deficit now into a gold lead as they lead the charge and this will be the story of the last game as it goes further it is just more dominance from echo and a great showing from our reigning world champions as they head into the MSC. Now I wonder, will the Orcas defend their title? Will they still be the world champions or will they fall to other competitors?